Hey, what's up, guys? We are now on to the home stretch of the regular season. It is the final week of the regular season, week 8. I only have two duels left. We're sitting very nice at 10-4 and four and clinch the playoffs. And definitely got some spoiler scenarios going on here. First matchup is going to be against Sheepy, uh, the other Minnesotan in the dual league. And she's fighting for her last spot in the playoffs. And then my other matchup will be against Apo who is currently fighting for the division in the one seed. So first off, it is Sheepy, it is a way matchup, and she picked Akusa. So here we go. Alright, we're getting started. Let's see what we get. Medford. Medford, Oregon, probably. We've got the plates to back us up there. We do. we got Central, and then we're going like Southwest. I'm going to go right here. Might not be the right street exactly, but she gets a pretty good score. And yeah. Alright, did pick the right place. It looks like we'll both 5k. And we did. Alright, moving on to round two. Got no front play in that old car. Could be Pennsylvania. I could definitely see Pennsylvania for this. Don't know if there's stop sign meta that I'm missing out on here. It's very possible. Um, and definitely somewhere in eastern Pennsylvania, I'm thinking. Somewhere like maybe in between Philly and Allentown. Let's go for that. And we'll see. Oh, and it was Connecticut. She gets down in Virginia. And that'll get me 900 points up. Moving on to round three. Here we go. Uh, New Mexico 96 is what it looks like we're on. We got a curve going uh, east and west. Can we find a 96? Real quick, we can. I'm going to guess right here. This might be a 5k. I really hope it is. We'll see. And it was a 5k. Very nice. Get us a thousand more points up as we move on to round four. We're at a railroad crossing. We're on a county road. Can't make out that sign. Uh, kind of thinking Arkansas, maybe. Think that would make the most sense with the landscape we got. We got no fronts, which definitely matches up for Arkansas. Can we pick up anything on this code? Newport. Or Nepal? Nepont? I don't know. I'm going to look in eastern Arkansas and see if there's any place that has that name. Or anything like that. Because I think that might be our best bet. Alright, she's just guessing. Newport, here it is. Hold on. We're going straight west. Let's guess up here. Ah, not quite. Okay, I was a little bit closer though. In a town called Luna. Alright, very nice. On to round five. Uh, water, Northampton. No fronts. Probably going to be Pennsylvania or West Virginia, maybe? Oh, no, Pennsylvania. Definitely got the blue on the bottom. Um, same thing. Feeling more eastern rather than western. And Northampton Street. Uh, I'm going to go for Bethlehem. Because that is, of course, Northampton County. It could just be Northampton straight up, but uh, I'm going to go for Bethlehem. Oh my goodness, it was just near Bethlehem. And that'll get us 200 more points. And we are moving on to the multipliers here for round 6. 
Here we go. Got Pond Meadow. Definitely northeastern that you got the stones on the side there. Remember what I st said about the stop signs that last round where I thought it was PA? Well, it was actually in Connecticut. Do I trust that again and go for Connecticut here? I'm kind of thinking yes. You got a lot of sun glaring on that license plate, so I don't think that's too reliable to knock it out. Um, yeah, I think I'm going to try Connecticut. I'll go, like, just west of Hartford here. <coughs> and it was Connecticut. Wow. Alright, I'll be a little bit closer once again. As we move on to round seven, what does this say? Lincoln Park! That is a neighborhood in Chicago uh, near DePaul University. Got Armitage and then Sheffield, maybe? Alright, let's quickly zoom into Lincoln Park. Armitage and Sheffield. Do I see an Armitage anywhere? Anywhere at all. Well, here's Armitage right here. And there's Sheffield. You're gonna be right here. Should get the 5k. Only reason I know Lincoln Park is because I've visited DePaul University. And I got the 5k. And we both did. Okay, very nice. On to round 8. We got 2.5 times damage now. Anything could happen. Got no fronts. Maybe some fronts. Kind of thinking Virginia, maybe? Somewhere in Nova. We don't have the Virginia signs, though, that we're used to seeing. We're in Maryland. Okay. Uh, let's definitely guess in the DMV, though. I'll go... I'll go Silver Spring. Don't think it's going to be a Baltimore suburb. Definitely feels more southern in a way. Very nice, and it was by Bethesda. And that'll take away 75 points as we move on to round 9. Here we go. US 60, Missouri 97. Very nice, very nice. Alright, US-60 is here. Alright, here we are in Yonkerville. We'll see if uh, she has good scanning skills. It's probably going to be simple enough that's in western Missouri. We'll see though. And that is another 5k. Alright, continuing to chip away. We are now on to round 10. Here we go. Connecticut 2 to Norwich. And Connecticut 83. Very nice. Okay, 2. Then 83. Where's 83? Right here. We'll be right over here. That's like the third Connecticut round that we've had. It's definitely a lot. And, oh, we both picked the wrong side. Look at that. And we both got 4999. Alright, on to round 11 now. Miskin. No front. This ever be Memphis? Ooh, actually, I don't know. Got a US Highway Shield. I don't know what it is, but I'm feeling Memphis. Oh, we got palm trees, though. I don't know. Do we, though? We kind of do. Maybe I'll go Florida Panhandle. I'll try Tallahassee. Oh, no! Is that gonna do it? Oh my goodness, it did! <laughs> wow! 
Oh my goodness. That's why you can never take the multipliers as a joke. They mean absolutely everything. Well, I just helped her chances of making the playoffs. <laughs> That's one thing for sure. Man. Oh my goodness. That is really unfortunate. That that is unreal. So that will do it. This is our fifth loss of the year. And it's not gonna get any easier. We're playing Apo next. I'll try to finish with eleven and five rather than ten and six just for seeding purposes, and that will do it. Thank you guys for watching. Be sure to like, subscribe, or leave a comment. I'd really appreciate it. And I'll see you next time.